roads around Razorback Stadium. 4029's Craig Cannon tells us how the Fayetteville Street Department is getting you ready for the winter blast. Even with the threat of snow this weekend, the head of Fayetteville Street Department told me he's expecting approximately 70,000 people or so to be on the roads for, Raz for the Razorback game this week. And they already have plans to give extra attention to the roads around the stadium, starting with Razorback Road right here. And then crews will clear MLK all the way from I-49 back over here to Highway 71, of course, north and south. And then from campus, Garland leads out to Weddington and then out to I-49. Those are other busy roads exiting the stadium area. Cleveland Street, always a steep, hilly street, and it's very busy, so they treat that heavily. And then getting away from the stadium, he said Township. Once you get away from the stadium, it's a busy road in Fayetteville off of North Gregg Street over to Crossover. And of course, college from downtown out to the Fulbright Expressway, you see it up here. The people, a lot of people take that route. That'll be heavily concentrated on, plus right by the stadium, of course, Maple over to Arkansas Avenue, over to Dixon, treated heavily, he said, because no matter what the weather, people will make their way over to the bar and restaurant area. Now, Director Terry Gulley said that they'll wait until Thursday or Friday to see the latest forecast before scheduling shifts around the clock. And he says if no rain is predicted, they plan on pre-treating all of the streets in Fable with salt brine to help melt any sleet and snow that falls. Craig Cannon, 4029 News. And we also found out the street department has two more snowplows to help clear the roads this winter.